Theater Bristol is celebrating its 59th year and starting on April 20th, the award winning children's book The Rainbow Fish is taking to the art space stage. Director Melanie Yodkins and cast member Elizabeth Mullins are here to share with us more about this wonderful production. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, uh, this The Rainbow Fish, I think everyone knows this story. I think so. It's a very well-known children's story, right. and um, it's it's really a delightful, delightful story. It's very colorful. It's very glittery, um, <laughs> as you can see. Right. Very glittery. <laughs> and t talk to us about you're the rainbow fish. Yes. How excited are you to be in this production? I'm extremely excited. T tell us more about it. Tell us more about your part and, and what it's been like through rehearsals and things of that nature. It's. <laughs> it's very amazing. Yeah. I mean, working with all these little kids, like, and bonding with them and just learning new things every day. I mean, the Rainbow Fish, she's, my character is, like, really mean to all of them. <laughs> but it's truly been an amazing ex experience with them and just um, learning with them through the way. And, yeah, that's what... That's what the rainbow fish is. She's she just learned through the show, and I've learned yes. so many things from the from these kids that I've been working with. And yeah. is, this is your this is your first show that you've done with Bristol with Bristol Theater Theater Bristol. It is. Talk to me about the experience you've had so far. I I really <laughs> love how I felt how accepted I felt in Theater Bristol coming in. Like, I felt so nervous, but when I walked in, I just felt like I belonged, and I felt I felt very accepted, and they were very, very welcoming, and it was just an amazing experience starting with Theater Bristol, and it's definitely something that I want to keep doing. Absolutely. Melanie, you were talking to me off camera. This is a community <laughs> effort. It yes. really is. This this production is a, a, a whole community coming together. Tell, yeah. me, tell me more about that. <clears throat> yeah, so we have... Um, 24 cast members um, and kid wise their age ranges are about five years old up to 14 yes um, we do have two adult cast members we will not talk about their ages of course <laughs> um, but uh, it's really a it's it's a community event we've got folks from Jonesboro Elizabethton um, a couple kids that come from Abingdon they're from all over the place and they're they're heavily involved and some of them are just so excited to be on stage and to tell this story in particular and we've got folks backstage who are putting together these incredible and magical costumes um you know we've it, it's really going to come to life our set is set in the coral reef and it's going to look like a coral reef and uh and it's just the whole thing is just magical and beautiful storytelling all the way around Tell us, you're the director. I am. And when you have a cast that goes from five all the way up to adult, I'm sure that offers some special challenges. It does. Um, huh. Kids, kids are so interesting to work with because they're so um, teachable, and that's really where I come from. My background, um, you know, I've been doing theater for over 25 years. I'm a director. I'm an actor. I'm an acting coach. You name it, I do it. But I. I especially come at it from a teaching perspective where these kids get to learn for the first time how to be an actor. Right. Um, our youngest one on set is actually my five-year-old son and um, being able to teach him and share this with him is one of the most beautiful moments of my life. All right. What do you want folks to walk away with when they when they leave this when they leave this production of the Rainbow Fish? Ooh, with a sense of community, All right. a joy of seeing live theater, All and right. the joy of storytelling in All person. Right. Well, thank you both for being here. Thank oh, you. it's going to be wonderful. Let's tell you about the Rainbow Fish. If you want it, it's theaterbristol.org for more information.